Gary, you're, uh, you're making your pro debut down in Liverpool on March the 10th. Yep, yeah, mate, yeah. BT Convention Centre. Yes, that's the one. And a, a little bit of an unusual one, because <laughs> you're making your pro debut, and you're fighting a guy who's making his pro debut. So yeah, someone's always yeah. got to go. Yeah, that's it, mate, isn't it? It's the name of the game, isn't it? <laughs> well, it's... It, it takes some balls to do this, you know what I mean? Because um, do do you know one another? Because he's from from uh, Liverpool himself. It's uh, yeah, mate, Mike Gerard, from, is it? Yeah, yeah, he's from Heighton, isn't he? I used to live in Heighton myself. Yeah. And and do you know one another from the? Yeah. Old, he, he was a good amateur. You were a good amateur. But again, like I said, I think he's about the similar to you, 12, 15 years ago when he was fighting as an amateur. Yeah, yeah, mate. I'll be able to about 17 years for me. Yeah, just a little bit longer. Um, yeah, he's he's years, isn't he? Um, yeah, it's gone blank there. <laughs> well, well, all I'm saying is, like, I mean, is this some rivalry? Why is this happening? Why, why have you agreed to fight a guy on his debut, and why has he agreed to fight you? Yeah, hey, I never agreed, you know, mate. I just said I'll fight anyone, anywhere, anytime, and <laughs> the, the fight was put to me, so I, I just took it. Um, we were supposed to fight with me in the white collar, so oh, right. that so was it. So there's a little bit of history between he, the two of you. Yeah, he's just a good ass yeah. scrapper, isn't he? And I'll just enjoy to share the ring with him, to be honest. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. No, no, it's uh, like I say, I mean, also as well, normally when you make your debut, you know, you're sort of like on the undercard, and uh, you know, the, the usual people that have come to see is just your fans and family. I think this is going to help to yeah. sort of show up. Yeah, because, me uh, too, should do, shouldn't it? It'll be a great fight anyway. <laughs> Yeah. And, and like you say, do you know much about uh, Mike's style or anything? Yeah, I know we've done the um, cage fighting and that, and he, he can bang and he can take a bang, so he's just good for the sport, isn't he? <laughs> and, and I've just seen you just doing a little bit of moving around here, a little bit of shadow boxing, a bit of bag work, and uh, a couple of little rounds there. What, what's your style like? Um, I'm a bit of everything, to be honest. Um, just like switching, be comfortable at what I'm doing, and it just comes from off my head. <laughs> yeah? Yeah. And where have you been training prior to this? Because you were down here at Lee Brundell's gym. Uh, yeah, I've, to, I've, just moved, this place, yeah I've just moved to Lee. I won't go into the um, into all the details, like, but I've just moved to this gym, Lee Brundell's. I, I knew him from the white collars as well, sparring oh, yeah. his boys and that. So I, I, when he, um, when he uh, like, split up with me cold sort of thing, I phoned him and he said straight away, yeah, come down. And, and uh, that was it then. I've um, stopped being in every day with Lee. been going now? Just outside of four weeks to uh, the fight night? Um, yeah, three weeks, isn't it? Yeah, three weeks. Three and a half Saturday, weeks. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, three weeks Saturday it'll be. Mm -hmm. And yeah. uh, how, how are you feeling? I'm feeling great, mate, you know, I can't wait to get in the ring. And when was the last time you was in the ring then? Um, in the white, in white collar was um, Barry Williams, as, um, I got beat. So um, I weren't fit enough, so mm -hmm. that, that gave me a kick up the arse and got me fitter. And got yeah, just before Christmas. Right. Oh, so it's not like you know what I mean. It's not like it's a totally new thing. Yeah, it's been yeah. Five years since you stepped through the ropes. Yeah. You, you've got that little bit of experience from from the white collar scene. Yeah, me. Yeah, yeah. But it's a lot different, isn't it, in the pro game to oh, the white totally collars? <laughs> but yeah. you're aware of that anyway. Yeah. So, you know, that's not a, that's an issue. It. And at least you have done the amateur uh, scene. Yeah, me, Even yeah. though it was a few years ago. Yeah. yeah. You will know what to expect. Yeah, me too. Yeah. I, I just love fighting, love boxing. It's, it's me at life, isn't it? You know, my kids are settling me down now, and it's all about them. Um, do you know what I mean? I just want to settle down now, make some money, and do as best as I can in the career. And and what do you think that could be? Um, do you have any uh, aspirations? Like, you know, do you think? Uh, I am a title know? fighter. Be good and get a belt. <laughs> yeah, and, and really, I just want I want to make money now. Get up the ladder, and. Um, me and Leo get up there at the end. Yeah. Well, I'd yeah. say when, when I was boxing, I, my aspirations, I would have loved to win a Central Area title. Yeah. And uh, I think we've got a guy who's holding the belt on that. Is Mukai fighting on that show? Yeah, I is think he? he is, mate, yeah. And there's an, a few debuts, isn't he? Debuts, Nathan Quillis. Uh, yes, yeah. yeah, yeah there's, there's, there's a, there's a few easy. lads on it, yeah. Little, little Willis, Luke Willis. Yeah, I think Lee just pulled off. He's, he's he? a little bit of surgery on his hand. Has he, yeah? Lee just pulled off. He's a cat guy, I know that. Um, yeah. All good local lads. And like I say, uh, yeah. Nice yeah, they used to show. train years ago with little Kenny Willis back, back in the day and oh, yeah. yeah, it's his dad isn't it, um, mm -hmm. 
Yeah, he used to train with uh, Jim back in the day when I was, when was I was in ABA champion, wasn't he? Yeah, yeah. He went to Olympics training for him. Yeah, I think so. Yeah, mate, there, there was a few good lads in that gym back in the day. He's got uh, in his blood. Yeah. <laughs> and then you got Tom Farrell on the road back to glory. Yeah, he's loving it at the minute, isn't he, Tom? <laughs> well, if he, if he comes through this fight, then he's fighting again uh, yeah. on the American show uh, the month afterwards. Yeah, Liverpool, yeah. Which yeah. is, again, another massive show. Yeah, he's got a few, hasn't he, Amir Khan coming up? Um, hasn't he just signed a contract for three fights? Yeah, yeah, he's fighting that Phil Lecrec, is it? Or something like that, Phil Lecrec. And uh, hopefully he comes through that and setting it all up for a, a fight with... Um, uh, Kel Brook, probably. Kel Brook, yeah, 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 I mean, yeah. yeah, that'll be a fight, won't it? Can't even Kel Brook will win it myself, like, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Well, yeah, it gives a, you know, a good gives luck to both of them, though, because we're all in it for the same thing, aren't we? And I hope them both well. Uh, well, they both done well out of it, but what yeah. do you think about the fight on this Saturday then? Uh, um, George Groves against. Um, oh, that's, yeah, Eubank. Eubank, um, I don't know. If, if Groves doesn't knock him out, Eubank on points. <laughs> yeah. 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 Mm-hmm. I think Eubank's got the speed and the. The it's a real 50-50 yeah. fight though, and yeah, it's a it good is. argument for yeah. both of them. And yeah. uh, people who know far more about boxing than me uh, yeah. are both picking either Groves or Eubanks. So there's not, it's not yeah. a, a general consensus. Yeah, I that think one fighter is going to win. Yeah, I think Groves got a little bit more power. <laughs> That's right. it. That's the only advantage I think he's got, and that's my point of view, though. But my point of view is, yeah, I think yeah. a good big man always beats a good little man. Yeah, that's it, mate. Yeah. 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 So, uh, the 10th of March, you're making your debut. Someone's always got to go. That's it, mate, isn't it? I'm <laughs> later on, I'm off to go and see your opponent anyway, Michael yeah. Gerrard. So, yeah. hopefully, both of our interviews will be up tonight, and we'll find out. Have you got any messages for him? Yeah, no, good luck, mate, isn't it? We'll share the night, and we'll share the ring on the night, and best man win. <laughs> Oh, nice. That's all I've got to say. That's what I like to hear. Yes. All right, mate. Good Take luck. Care. Yeah, man. You too. Ta-ra, mate. Ta-ra. Bye. Bye.